Hi everybody, day 30 of 31 days on how to radically change your prayer life. Pastor Ed Taylor here. You know, back here behind me are a lot of books, a lot of things in there, a lot of wisdom, a lot of knowledge, a lot of teaching in there. But we are supposed to be living and teaching and preaching and talking and praying the Word of God. God's Word is how we find out God's will. And with all the knowledge that's out there from all kinds of sources, the place we need to get our knowledge on how to pray correctly and pray is, a, is from God's Word so we can pray God pray according to His Word. You know, Hebrews chapter 4, verse 12 says that the Word of God is a living thing and it divides and separates the soul from the spirit. Praise God for the power of His Word. When we're praying according to the Word, we're not praying selfishly. We're not praying according to our, our overwhelming selfish desires. We're praying out the will of God. And when we get that Word of God in prayer, then God can speak to us. And as Kenneth Copeland once said, one word from God can change your life forever. So when we go into our prayer closet and we spend time with God, let's make sure that we're praying the Word. So tomorrow, Day 31, the final day of our 31 days. But until then, we're praying the word.